Let's do look for you. Uh, yeah. Uh, no. I was gonna pack matches too, but I thought, who's gonna ask me for? Food? Well, actually, I'm gonna ask you for a cigarette. <laughs> yeah, I don't smoke. <laughs> oh, that's good. But if I did, I know it's good. But if I did, I would give you one as well. Oh, that's so sweet. Do you want me to hold something, like the beer or the camera? Oh, this is this is crayon. This is made in Germany. That's a, yeah, super. See? Where, but? Uh, so, how do you know that somebody loves you? <laughs> You don't know. No. Well, you, is it possible you, to know? At, yeah, at some point you say you know. You know, but... Yeah. But it's just because you feel like you know. But it's not like you can actually know. Can you? Depends on the Can you know that someone loves you? Ah! If they write you a lot of letters, I think. They call you a lot and tell you that they love you. Um, uh, of course. I, I think somebody shows you affection and, and sticks with you and is loyal and and will listen to you and talk to you. I think that's a really good sign that somebody. Different crush. I will show you the lucky one, but then you first tell me. Then how do you know if somebody loves you? Well, I have so much problem with it. <laughs> but I think you feel it. Even if it's like very little things, like really the, I think the little things come. Yeah. Like I really, not like you, you never, oh yeah, he will never tell you that he loves you, but when he's like, like little gestures, I think then you know, you can be quite sure. Nice. Knowing somebody loves you is almost the same as saying that you know there's a God. It's almost more to do with faith or belief or whatever that's personal and uh, it's not something that's scientifically provable. And maybe at some point it will be scientifically provable. Maybe it's a chemical and it's only present in gold or in love, which is, you know, and you can test to see if people have it for you, but I think right now it's like Butterflies. Butterflies on my sweaty back. How can I? I don't know. I don't know. Is there a proof of love? Um, I would think so. <laughs> it's hard to say. What do you think, Nick? Is there any proof? Is there any way to know? Uh, how do you know if somebody loves you? You, 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 don't, you can't know. You never know. No. How do you know that? You don't. You don't. You don't know. Really? You don't think it's possible to know? Do you think it's possible to know? And if he loved me when I came to the last petal, then I would know for sure. It, it's proven to be true. <laughs> you know, when they start to do completely unselfish things and sacrificing their own, you know, things for, for your own benefit. You're just overwhelmed by these warm, sparkly feelings, and you can just, you know that they love you or else they wouldn't know. Right? And I need 
mean, how many times do people talk about, like, you know, being in a relationship and thinking they're madly in love and then finding out this person's cheating on them or that person's lying to them or, you know, all of a sudden somebody be like, guess what, actually I want to break up right now. Um, so that can, like, catch you off guard and you might have thought the person felt the same way about you and turns out they didn't. I think people are incredibly good at fooling themselves and fooling other people into thinking they're in love with Question is what do you do when you do when you see something else you Yeah, what do you do? I uh, know, wait. I answer I ask this question. <laughs> I usually wait for the other person to do a move because I could be wrong, you know? It's like uh Okay. Um, Does it matter if you're wrong or right? Like we're talking about love, you know? Hmm? We're talking about love. I know. Hey Elizabeth. Mademoiselle. Um <laughs> I heard you almost got in an accident, or you go. Oh yeah, just now. Yeah, I was completely. Alive. Um, uh, do you know when uh, when there's proof of love? No. Okay. Do I know when there's proof like of love? Like <laughs> or whatever the question is I mean, like, that you ask me. While riding. So I was talking about that on the way over. Yeah. I all the when? things when I ride here too, but I don't. Uh, I've, um, I've been doing a lot. And, I do. and it was like a big box truck. When I'm in my like kitchen on the side, yeah, and I'm pouring the the eggs into the pan. Like it didn't seem like it got that. And then I that know. was it. That was almost it. <laughs> What's your favorite kind of ice cream? Bubblegum ice cream, the kind with the little pieces of bubblegum in it. It's always been my favorite. I like to suck out the little pieces of bubblegum and then spit them into a little cup and eat them all. Together. <laughs> How do you know if somebody loves you? Man, I don't think you ever know. Maybe if they tell you they do. And you trust them. Maybe it's more if you love them. More if you love them. Yeah, and then you can trust that they love you. Are you recording me right now? <laughs> thing. Mm. You cannot believe it. I think, I think you have to leave it up to to uh, the, the the workings of your human chemistry that you that are out of touch with comprehension. Yeah. I left my bag over there. I guess it's probably okay. Fuck you. Oh. Fuck you. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>